So the hunt for Planet X was like this massive planet. It was a planet hunt like none other. Percival Lowell of the New England Lowells <laughs> loved astronomy, mm -hmm. was not formally trained, but he, he had money, built an observatory, the best one in the world. He, wow. he was the first to figure out, put the telescope on the mountaintop Mount, okay. above the low cloud layers. So he found a mountain in Arizona. Okay. okay, where else are you gonna put it, right? Arizona. There you go. Found a mountain, built an observatory. Finest optics, finest everything. The observatory's called? Uh, the Lowell Observatory. Thank you, the Lowell Observatory. He starts a systematic survey in the plane of the solar system. Okay. A photographic survey. Now, how do you discover a planet? It has to be a dot of light in one photo then in another photo, it is moved to a different spot. Right, yeah. Okay? So he initiates this, brings in Clyde Tombaugh to conduct the survey. 1930 is the announcement. Planet X discovered. Oh, by the way, it got named Pluto. There's a dot in one photo, and it's moved to another place in another photo. Mm. Well, how big was it? What mass was it? They assigned it the mass that Planet X would have to be to perturb Neptune in the way we discovered it. Right. Over the decades, we find out it's not as big and not as massive right. as they said it was. We, we found a moon. Its mass was like one-fifth the mass of our moon. Yeah, so in the 90s, it got demoted. He died before it was officially demoted. Mm. 